Hi, this is Walford Kaufman bringing you another devotion. I just want to share with you about a, a movie I remember as a child. And yes, that was a long time ago, but even as a child, this was an old movie. And the name of it was Pale Face. And starring it was Bob Hope. Of course, it was a comedy, but he was, I think, from the from the east, and he had made his way out to the west, and uh, he was kind of a chicken. But all of a sudden, he was coming in battle with the Indians, and they captured him. And for what I remember about the movie, they were going to kill him by tying him in between two trees. And this is how they did it. They, they bent one tree over and they tied one leg to that. And they bent another tree over and tied one leg to that. And what they were going to do was they were going to cut those trees loose and they were going to fly back open. And of course, that was to kill him. And it was not a gruesome movie. It was a comedy. So what happened was they cut the tree. He was expecting that to be the end. But what happened was they had uh, put the rope around his boots as such. So when it flew open, guess what? One tree slipped. The other one, it just it catapulted him. I don't know how far away, but he was safe. But I think about that so many times in that movie, how we, especially as believers, trying to hold on to the world and hold on to God. That's not going to happen, folks. Oh, oh, yeah, it can happen, but there's going to be danger. Anytime we're trying to hold on to the world and hold on to the Lord, we're going to be divided. We're going to be always hurting and always in pain. And so we need to be reminded that the Lord tells us to be faithful to Him. In 2 Corinthians, the fifth chapter, we see here in verse 9 starting, So we make it our goal to please Him, whether we are at home in the body or away from it. For we must all appear before the judgment seat of Christ, that each one may receive what is due Him for the things done while in the body, whether good, Scripture says here, whether good or bad. So watch out, folks. Hold on to the world. What is that going to get us? We need to hold on to the Lord today. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, we thank You that You are the one reaching out to us, pursuing us, loving us. And Lord, all You want us to do is to claim You and You only. Forgive us for trying to hold on to this world. Forgive us trying to make You happy and make the world happy. Lord, you're for us for eternity, and we want you to be number one in our hearts. Lord, forgive us, and Lord, us now, right now, start getting, getting our lives straight and start serving you with all that we are. Lord, bless each one that's watching this, listen to this, and thank you this day that you love us with a passionate heart. In Jesus' name, amen. May the Lord bless you this day.